by you. Let's go. Me, doctor, lawyer, scientist, and teacher. I'm a guy who read me. How will you say him? He's a job. Okay. I don't want to say anything. I don't want to say anything. I live against some people. But you have a nice hockey tree right in the line there. That the hockey tree in the Rasta. And that the hockey tree the theme wife. Support the family half. And actually, you are the most faithful hockey tree me ever see. It'd be enough. And it's sweet. So when she pick, when she pick, I will I pick the neckline the tree. Or the hockey tree, hockey tree like a woman in the yard. But you husband want a dirty man. When you have a grow up, so and you know, next to you, you have pick one of the not like that. So, when I tell you, when you have a beer off now, when you have done beer, it's a, bl it a blossom again, you know? The last time you pick up a tree, you have to a blossom again. Because God has supported you. You know, run out. No! I don't know how to get a tree out of it. Yeah, you know, man. So one week, the woman got to market. And when she come home, in the night, the kid she chopped down. The woman said, wait, I want, I want. The woman said, huh? I want to pick up, I want to pick up your kid. The woman said, what do you do? And what the fuck you do, man? You mean, you want to get you with your support, we? You cut it down because you want to pick up too. When you go out there, people you go pick breadfruit and the cake, and the whole of the yam, go to the breadfruit tree. And you want to get you to the picnic, and I ask you to buy the uniform. And yet, people come to come buy hockey, and we take it by flour, by rice, by meat, and we eat up the hockey tree. Why are you chopping down? Then guess what? The hockey tree drop on one woman's house. When in traffic? Yes! Yes, man. The hockey, the hockey, which part of the hockey tree? And the woman's father give her that piece of land, you know, and for the husband. The husband, the people, them give him a piece of land, out there, so. but no house to the money. But the human father give her the place with her little house, and they live in her. So when you mash up the human house, and the human car don't value it and value the house, no. He not have no money, the human said, what are you going to do now? I must be human house. When I tell you, woman gonna mark it, we are one like a tricky fire man coming and say, Master, you man have your coat, so I'll allow you to sell him, sell him, we have out there, so. Tell me you about $10,000, brother. And money, you know. For 200 square land, you know, that's all he have for himself, you know. I feel people they give him that. The human people they give him, give him the land where they live, man. So, the man said to him, say, all right, maybe buy the piece of land for this for you, you know. And you get the money to pay the woman for your house. So the woman come home from the market, man. I asked him, so why? He said, everything good, man. Then you heed that. Sell the land for the dry $10,000. Sell it for 12 dollars no? And get some more after you, after, you, after, after, you, after you pay the woman for the house. He said, for the dry $10,000. The woman said, you chop down your yankee tree. No, you sell it, and then you pay your pity in the market with them all. You said, they want me to do me if you pay you money. You bastard. You get what him deserves. Stop it, You must in the market. So she stopped coming on past at the night now. Him don't get her heart tapped to turn because you money, you want to land, you know. You man get it 10,000 if you pay if you fix back her house. The wife. Start coming on Sunday morning, brother. And Sunday he will start take over. And he will quarrel. All the while, since I've left, he will come on Saturday night time. Eh? What happened? He said, listen to me. I don't no more hockey chief. He climbs to a hockey chief. He climbs down to Bumbo Clark. Remember that, people. That's what you want to tell him? Yeah. You must say, I don't no have no more, no more hockey to support me. So we know I'm a hockey chief who climbs right now, a hockey chief, me a climb. <laughs> Yo, from that day, you see, from that day, the married life just mash up. And. The man get what he deserves. Chat down, hockey chief. I support them so much, but because neighbor picked two. 
chap him. He got dropped by a certain woman's house. He lose the whole piece of land where he have to fix back the woman's house. He get smoke on them nasty. That ain't nasty. You too wicked, man. Dirty nasty, man. Wicked. I'm talking to you. A reality and a joke thing. So when you talk about you, man, you know, come home, you must say, remember, me no more, I mean, no, I no more, I can't you climb. So right now, I can't get you to climb. If you support us. In your lineage with the young ones, you must say, I can't get you. And she's not a joke. Because she's not a joke. Because my time, I didn't do nothing. I had to clack you to get you to get you to get you. You must say right now, me nah, me nah get no, me nah have no hockey tree if you go claim no more. Cause you chop it down right now, a hockey tree me a claim. <laughs> oh God! You see, you see, you want to live so? In nearly dead. <laughs>